Hey, turn me up now. Turn me up now. Hey, turn me up now. We got a package. Wow. <laughs> the balloons say I love you. Oh my gosh. So, I'm getting ready to get my hair done. My braids are out. Okay, y'all, so I just made it to my hair appointment. I got my hair. I'm about to get a bob. And I get away. This is my first time seeing this lady, so I'm excited. I tell y'all a story about my previous appointment with someone else a little later. But hey, the birthday look is coming together. Hey, the B Day Bob is in action. She looking real chic. She looking real sleek. Now we just gotta get this face together. So oh, I don't actually have plans for my birthday. I was very much so wanting to just lay low and oh, this line on my forehead. I wanted to just lay low and you know, you don't feel birthday ready until your hair is done. My birthday is actually Monday. It's February 18th. So my birthday is on the 20th. So I'm headed home. I know Will probably has some tricks up his sleeve on the rest of the day. So I'll holla at y'all when I get back home. Okay. I'm in the garage. Let's see what Will think about my hair because he been dying for me to get a bob for a long time. So I know he about to act the bob. crazy mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. damn you look grown and sexy type shit this shit look for real i know that's what she was saying like this damn near every day oh yeah i gotta get this every every, every month time, yeah because yeah. this is like i might switch it up right now again but this, but this is giving this giving um i don't even know it's martin and auntie. gina yeah it's giving like fine you know they turn around right there oh yeah it's hard this is this yo this the new Man, that's what's up. You like it? Yeah. Okay. Now I'm about to open a package. Oh, from okay. Yeah, just like that. Oh, yeah. Like Let me get some. Okay, I guess I don't need it. Venus glass mug. Venus double. I think my mom gets stuff that she likes for me because. I don't really know what this is. Double walled glass cup. Maybe this might come in handy for teas. Yeah. Maybe you actually could like, maybe it helps hold the tea bag and keeps it more. You can like take it out of the house. You look way different. It's like you look, I don't even know, more proportional now or something. More like, proportional. Take your glasses off. Yeah, that's giving. Yeah, that's cold. Yeah, I love it. That's cold. That's. A, I was hoping it would look like this. Yeah, that was from Madre. I do not like my this tripod anymore. It it's just swinging all over the place. I don't like it. Okay, 
pretty good. Some of the water went down. Mm. Mm. I made red beans and rice. <laughs> I told you just give me Edna more. <laughs> and I'm about to take a nice rejuvenating bath. I call this the birthday bath. So I have a lot of skin related things that I need to show you guys because it's been quite some time since I had this like get ready with me vlog posted. Um, as you guys know, I made a transition in my career and that has been such a lovely thing. And yeah, so I hope you enjoy this montage of my birthday self-care. Get ready with me. the shower I'm feeling real clean the birthday bath was a vibe so my skincare routine let's talk about it I've done some montages of my skincare routine before in recent vlogs if you haven't seen any of them go on back check it out I have been using the same cleansing bar since 2019 and I've noticed that that same cleansing bar that I found in 2019 which was like five, six years ago was no longer giving my skin that feel and that glow that I was looking for. And I was using a clarifying cleansing bar by Urban Skin. This is my favorite line. It even has like a little thing saying that it's a clarifying cleansing bar. And at the time when I was using this brand or this specific cleansing bar, I had really acne prone skin. And it says deep cleanse, pores and oily blemish prone skin and as of recently I've just discovered that I needed to revamp my cleansing like not necessarily my entire skin routine but the cleansing aspect of it so now I use the same brand urban skin but this is their resurfacing cleansing bar a powerful multitasking cleansing bar that resurfaces to smooth and brighten the appearance of dull complexion so I noticed that my skin was looking a little dark like in certain areas I just wasn't getting that like I don't know it, I was getting a glow but like it's just still I felt like this area, this area, and I was getting like some hyperpigmentation and like texture in my skin as of recently. And I'm like, I need to change my cleansing bar. So this is for the brightening. The vitamin C, it smells so interesting, but it has a lot of good key and geek ingredients. It doesn't smell the best, but I love it so far. For a while, I have been using this exfoliator by Urban Skin. So this scrub mask is called Purifying 2-in-1 Pumpkin Pore Detox Mask and Scrub. Soothes, clarifies, improves appearance of pore size. And this is from the Restore. This is from the Restore collection that they have. I also found my skin doesn't really need this all the time because it doesn't have any brightening aspects. It's more clarifying and detoxifying like the cleansing bar. So these two I use together. Now I use a completely different exfoliator by them, which is this one. This is called Brighter Days Dark Spot 8% AHA Polish. This exfoliates dead skin, smooths rough textures, and brightens, and is from their Even Tone collection. This is a win, along with the brightening, resurfacing, vitamin C cleansing bar together, is a win. I've already been using it for like a week now, and I've seen great results. Now for my mask, I typically like to use three to four facial masks. I like clays, I like creams, and I like gels on my skin, depending on how I'm feeling. So I think today what I might go in with is either, since I, I wore makeup, I might just do an enzyme mask. I'll be back. Like since turning 28, I feel like 
now I'm into anti-aging products now. I am really trying to keep the rejuvenation, firmness, and collagen in my skin. So I am on it with all the serums and everything like that. So what I like to use as far as masks go, cater to more, I don't know, feel good things and also treating my skin also. So this is the Urban Skin Enzyme Mask, which I really love. This radiance boosting enzyme mask exfoliates and renews dull, uneven skin. This is a game changer. I love it, I love it, I love it. Also, this kind of comes out in a jelly like form i keep this refrigerated because it feels really good when it's refrigerated i also keep this um super boot resurfacing mask by peach and lily in the refrigerator too because both of these feel so good when they're like cold it's very cooling and relaxing to my skin so definitely definitely i would recommend these two masks then i have a bio two bio elements clay mask and this is a restorative kind of sort of mask this deep i really love this mask it's super creamy it feels good it has like a pulsating like mineral kind of vibe going on that stuff this is that stuff it helps with like um lymphatic drainage and things like that it says to you like it takes seven days for it to like start detoxifying the lymphatic drain and drain system this is a clay mask that I really love. It's a restorative, restorative clay mask. This is kind of just like your basic creamy clay formula that I really love for just like day to day. I use this maybe two times a week. I use this like maybe three times a week. This I use like once every other week because it will literally have your skin on glow mode for so long. So I try not to go too crazy with those. Now as for serums and moisturizers, Urban Skin has what you need for the serums and moisturizers. So this is the Even Tone Super Glow Serum. I like to use this during the day, and I like to use this new baby right here, the Reti Glow Gentle Resurfacing Night Owl Vitamin E Serum from their Restore line. Um, gently exfoliates rough texture. I love this. This feels so good. This is a lot more sticky and like, I don't know. It just, it's like, this is a very sticky formula whereas this is a more oil-based formula, which I love because it just really gets in there and this isn't so sticky. It's just very like light. So I, I put this on at night and this gives me a bomb.com glow. So both of these are from the Restore collection. And then these are from the Even Tone collection along with this cleansing bar. Even Tone. Um, now for moisturizers, I use this and this. Not together, but just depending on how I'm feeling. Now this is more of my summertime moisturizer. Um, I get this from Sephora and it's the Sea Rush Brightening Double Cream. I love this stuff. It smells so citrusy and good. I've had this since the summer and I still have some left. A little goes a long way, but this will have your skin feeling lovely. So I keep this refrigerated. I keep these also refrigerated. Now this is the Even Tone Barrier Repair by Urban Skin. It even has the Even Tone um, collection. It's from the Even Tone line also. It hydrates and improves look of uneven skin. It's super moisturizing, like I love this. As you can see, it's almost gone. The top fell off, so don't judge me. But yeah, that is my skin routine. So. Happy birthday to Africa. Happy birthday to you. Was you even recording? Yeah. My camera finna die, so. Oh, it's all Everybody. three lights on. It's three lights on. We got little Baalini oh, cakes. Let you take me to Magic City. Mm. What boy? Okay, slow down. 
What? Mm. A heart attack? Mm. Oh, Jesus. What, 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 where is she? Oh, okay, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll All right, guys. This is the end of this birthday you vlog. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on? Regina had a heart attack. Turning great. Never felt so great.